You probably already know this, but just in case you don't, never walk on bare ground on a slope when it's raining. Now you see this hill. Okay, you can see that there's leaves covering part of the path. And then there's bare parts. There's leaves on the other side. Now, although it might be safe, it might be solid enough and gravelly enough, it's likely that your foot will slip when you walk on something like that. And it'll slip right out from under you and you'll fall on your back end. Now, you see where it is? Um, huddled up. And there is stuff on it, but I would not take a chance walking there. Well, that is pretty solid. The mud may have all washed away. Nevertheless, the safest thing to do is to avoid it completely. safest thing to do is walk on the side where there are well well traveled well whatever leaves hmm. interesting eco scout adventure I was a girl scout I was a junior scout I never did make it to senior. By then I was off exploring the world on my own. Exploring all the woods. I guess I learned a lot from Girl Guides. Or Girl Scouts. Yet another bridge. Now here we are down in between in a subdivision. I have not explored this way yet. that stream is. Sweet gum. This is a gum tree, I guess. Kookaburra sits in the old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bushes he. La, kookaburra, la. Kookaburra, gay, your life must be ha ha. Kookaburra sits in the old gum tree. Mer merry king of the bushes he. La, kookaburra, la. Kookaburra, okay, your life must be ha ha. I don't know the other verses. We used to sing that as a round. Now, if the water's sitting, notice this. Somebody has slipped a little bit. It's going to be going to be more likely that you can slide on that. So put your weight completely on one foot and then move it to the other. I love the sound of the rain. I guess it floods. Hence the sand. 
that it used to go straight through. Be careful of a place like this where it's a little bit sloped. It is March the 11th, 2010, Athens, Georgia. This is that plant. I think my mom has some of this. It gets these tall little yellow flowers on it. They really smell fragrant too. See how big this tree is? This is my hand, and that is a tree. Huge, 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 huge. Lots of big trees in here. Oh, look, a wood duck house. Was that a was that a thrush? A wood thrush or a hermit thrush? Where'd the duck house go? There it is. And look at that. Something's been staying in there. Oh look, these are edible mushrooms. These are puffball mushrooms. Of course, once they're old, once they're old, they get a hole in them and they explode. But when they're young, is that bubble gum? Somebody put their chewing gum on there. That is artist conch, which is a kind of bracket mushroom you can paint on. They usually grow on trees. I guess this was a tree upon which it must have grown. This almost looks like chicken of the woods. But it's not bright orange. Maybe it will be. They're edible. Chicken of the woods. But never eat a mushroom unless you're absolutely sure. Somebody's been having fun breaking these off. Children.